What's up? My name is Brew. It is an Odyssey check-in with the one and only, the multi-talented. You know her from Blackpink. You know her from Money. Oh. <laughs> we welcome Whoa. Lisa in. How are you? I'm good. I'm good to be here. Oh, so it's so nice good to see you. you. I know. I'm, I've been so looking forward to this check-in, and I'm sure you've just been all over the place, so busy. But we'll start with just that, a check-in. How have you been? Like, what you been up to? Um, I'm just here for, you know, promotion for money and I'm just, you know, meeting up with friends. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Just Catching here all for up. a week. Yeah. Absolutely. And how's, how's the past like 18 months been with the pandemic and all that? Uh, I mean, you've been staying busy or did you take some time for yourself? Oh, no, I always stay busy mm -hmm. and I just want to, if I have free time, I just want to stay in home to stay, you know, safe. <laughs> Absolutely. Yeah. But all the time I'm in like studio do some recording, yeah. I know, and we're anxiously awaiting the big debut project, your first solo album. Yeah. And first thing I think about when you take that transition from doing a group project mm -hmm. to your own thing, mm -hmm. how does the prep change? Like, what was different this time? Oh, um, it's not that much different, mm -hmm. but for me, I feel like I always have like my girls by my side. Like, I feel like, like. You know, I feel mm -hmm. safe, but without without them, I feel like, oh my God, like I have to do everything by myself. Like I'm kind of worried, but it's okay. Guess yeah. they're always one call away. You yeah. can always hit them up. Yeah, and, and they, they, they come to me and like cheering me up. Mm -hmm. So yeah, they're so sweet. Yeah. Have you reached out from time to time just when Super you... Super supportive. Yeah. Well, that's amazing. Yeah. Well, I love uh, the way you've done it where you've released a couple, you know, teases of what's coming mm -hmm. on the album. Um, but I always think messaging gets kind of lost on albums where, uh, you know, we find a couple songs that we love and you don't really listen to the whole thing. Mm -hmm. As a whole in this album that you're working on, what's kind of the message behind it? The message is, you know, the song is like about me, mm -hmm. me, Lalisa, and money is like, it's a song that like, I, I kind of like because I like hip hop. And well, um, I think it's a great combination because the title is Lalisa, it's totally me, about mm -hmm. me, and money is like a song that you can like vibe it, like, you know. Yeah. So I, re I, I, I really like the, the both of them, yeah. Focusing on you, mm -hmm. living your best life. <laughs> Are you uh, learning new stuff about yourself as you're working on something like this? Yes, like I got to know me better, mm -hmm. <laughs> like, because I have to, you know, I'm involved in um, the album design too. Mm -hmm. Like even though picking my outfit for the music video, like get to know me better. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so it's kind of challenging, and I have fun with, you know, preparing things. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Well, you talk about how uh, music for you is all about like confidence. You know. Mm -hmm. What do you do when sometimes maybe your confidence isn't all there? Because I feel like we have those days, you know? Yes, do you do course. a pep talk? Do you have a routine, something to get you back into it? A pep talk is like, the, it's important mm -hmm. sometimes, you know? Um, I do call my mom, ask her like... We all do. We gotta yeah, call the mom, you know? I gotta call mom. You know, like after I talk with her, I feel like, okay, refresh. Mm -hmm. I feel like, okay, I can do my work now. Like, I'm okay to do. Yeah. That's always like the number mm -hmm. one, you know, mm -hmm. your mom. Like, mm -hmm. that's mom, always your family, number one supporter. Dad, yeah. They've all, they're so supportive of you. Yes, yes. That's amazing. Mm -hmm. So, the two new songs that you've released uh, as we're waiting for the whole project, Lalisa, I mean, you've had some really cool inspirations on that song with some different sounds. Mm -hmm. What'd you include in that? Oh, um, in Lalisa, mm -hmm. um, it's about me because the song name is Lalisa. It's <laughs> of me. course. So, I, I told my uh, producer, Teddy, that. Oh, I really want to put some like Thai vibe. Mm. Like even though like in the music video, I wanted to show them that because they don't like some of them they didn't they don't know that I'm from Thailand mm -hmm. that I'm Thai, right? So, I just want to, you know, show them that, you know, who I am. And, so true too. Yeah, and, I had to look that up as well. I was like, oh my oh. gosh, what is this influence? Because I, I was uh -huh. like something we've never heard before. And I think that's why people are taken to it so well. But mm -hmm. it's so interesting you decided to use some of those, you know. Yes. And they're so nice that they're like, okay, mm -hmm. let's do it. Like they say, okay. Yeah, they're like so positive with it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And then money blowing up on mm. like first time I ever heard it was oh. TikTok. Like I, I'm a big oh, TikTok you guy. TikTok, yo. See everyone doing dances. Everyone's yeah. doing the trends. I did the dance. Oh. <laughs> I tried. Oh. <laughs> Not pretty. It flopped. <laughs> but 
Money is a cool story as well. Like you really fell in love with the song when you heard was it yes. a demo? Yes, like as soon as I heard it, I was like, oh my God, I need to do this. Like mm -hmm. this is gonna be my solo song, like mm -hmm. for sure. And Teddy said, Teddy's agree with, and yeah, we tried, and I think, voila. <laughs> what, what was it about it? Was it the demo? How raw was it? Was it like right when you heard the beginning, like the very uh, infant stages of the song before it was all produced? Or um, It's like, it's just a demo, like mm -hmm. a normal demo. But as soon as I hear, I was like, I can imagine me dancing already mm. in that song. Yeah. Yeah, so I think now everyone it, else is doing it. Yeah. Like literally it everybody just else. It just click. Uh huh. Yeah. We talk about adding Thai elements, and mm -hmm. you just resonate so well with um, so many different cultures. I don't know if you knew this. I want to make sure I get it right. You're the first K-pop musician to hit number one on Billboard's Latin sales chart, which what? is Latin? Oh. Latin sales chart. How? <laughs> right? Because you just you resonate so well with so many people. You have fans from all across the world. What do you think oh. resonates so well with them? I think um, I have like um, blinks around the world. Mm -hmm. That's why. So maybe they're like noticing me, and there's they're like been waiting for my solo for so long too. Mm -hmm. And I'm so happy that you know they love my songs mm -hmm. because I love my songs. <laughs> yeah. And I'm happy that they're like having a good time listening my, my song. Right. Yeah. And it shows through. You can tell like you doing what you love and mm -hmm. now focusing on yourself. Mm -hmm. It's they can tell like this is the real you. No. Um, you're getting to do some fun other project. You got to work with DJ Snake and yes. Megan Thee Stallion, Ozuna wow. and SG. Mm -hmm. What's the dynamic to work with like such different artists? Um, it's for, unfortunately that mm -hmm. I can get to meet them and mm -hmm. film the music video together with them. Yeah. But but still like I can feel it in the song. Like when I hear like mm -hmm. Ozuna sing, Megan rap, and me together collaboration is like oh so interesting. I really like it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But I I want to meet them like and oh yeah, you have know. to do this song live at some point. Yeah. You know, yeah, you'll, you'll all want, be together I at some do point. Stage with them. Like, oh, it'd be so please. fun, <laughs> especially with Megan. Oh my gosh, she's just like oh my god, the real hot imagine. girl stuff. She'll get you. Yes, oh. <laughs> show you all the moves. Mm -hmm. um, all the twerking things. <laughs> yeah. I want to learn from her. <laughs> I know, right? Yeah. It's tough. I try. Again, <laughs> failed that one too. Um, with this pandemic and everything, it's been uh, a blur in time. Like, I, it's hard to tell, like, oh, that was two years ago already. Already, time flies. Can you believe that ice cream oh. has been over a year now? What? With Selena, it's been like 13 months. I looked it up, or maybe 14, almost a little longer than a year. Uh, Already, huh? I know, and now you're doing a similar path where you're on your own journey. Mm. When working on something like that with Selena, did she give you either mm. just from observing her or mm. any advice that she gave you that you kind of stuck with? Um, we have like um video chat for like a few times, mm. and she really nice. Like she gave me like she gave us like um you know like a positive energy, and I'm I really want to see her again and. If I can work with her again, I would love it too. That's so nice. Mm -hmm. And then with K-pop, just continually, to just it's like a trajectory of this. It keeps getting bigger and bigger, I feel like, with every yeah. song and every year and every mm -hmm. project. Mm -hmm. um, is there anybody in K-pop you have an eye on or that you would love to do a collab with? Mm, at the I, moment. I'm not sure for the moment. I don't okay. I never like thought of. Mm -hmm. But yeah, maybe, you know, if I have a chance to do to collab with someone, I'll be like, always, yeah. always listening. Yeah, always got open air. Mm -hmm. We love it. And then as time's flying, we're coming up on <laughs> the holidays already. Oh, do you have oh, yeah. plans for it? Have you started shopping <laughs> or oh. anything like that? What's your <laughs> <laughs> right? I'm the worst. Um, for me, um, I really want to go meet my family in Thailand mm -hmm. because I haven't seen them for like you know almost two years. But I just met my mom. She she came to see me like. Three weeks ago. Okay. <laughs> anyway, but I want, I really want to go to Thailand. Yeah. yeah. Holidays are here, and you know, so many different coffee shops, they do their twist on drinks. Do you have like yeah. a favorite oh. holiday classic you go to? I'm a chocolate lover, Ooh. so I would say hot chocolate mm. for sure. <laughs> Something about like the holidays where it gets chocolatier and chocolatier, if that's a word, you know, they just get. Uh -oh. <laughs> this is the time to chocolate. drink it. You drink it year round, though? Like all the time? Or <laughs> just I get, holidays? like every week. Every week, yeah, gotta chocolate. hit that quota. Yeah, love it. So you're gonna have a busy schedule coming up. You're gonna be all over. What's something you do to take time for yourself and ensure you have like a good mindset and mental health to stay on track? What's some of your things you like to do? 
like what I talk, like what I say to you is like I call my mom. Mm-hmm. Like, and sometimes when I rest, like at home, I just playing with my cats. Mm. It's really like helps a lot with the. Oh my like, gosh! Yeah. I think that's scientifically proven. Like yeah. cats or dogs. And do you know that when I look, I feel down. The cats like comes to me. Oh my gosh! And they just like be like in this like side of me. It's like they know. But it's already like stress like it's gone wow yeah but it's, it's like your cats know like oh she needs know, some they help know, they know. it's kind of like cows they sit when it rains you know that when it's really? about to rain whoa I, I didn't, I <laughs> that's didn't like a know midwest that. thing that's a midwest <laughs> american know. thing oh, but okay. cows sit before it rains okay so your cats are like that with today. sadness i learned one today <laughs> yeah the rain the cat's rain is sadness that's how they know oh. um, are you a podcast girl at all do you like podcasts I never heard of it. Yeah, it's like, you know, it, we're just so, there's so many different things with audio now, mm-hmm. and we have so many podcasts. I was just curious if you listen to anything like that, but you probably are so busy, don't I have time. I've never to, heard, I have to check it out. Yeah. Like, if you recommend Yeah, me. I'll get you one. I do one. I'll send it to you. Oh, <laughs> See okay. if you like okay. If you have some downtime. Um, what other passion projects are you working on? Do you have anything like lanes you want to go down in the future? Mm, I haven't think about it yet, mm-hmm. but I would love to try, like, like, I feel like fashion you would, you know, do really well in. Oh, fashion. I mean, look at that jacket. You're killing it. The oh, nails. the pink. The it's rings. Like, it's all color coded. I have pink. one thing on. I try my best. Uh, <laughs> I'm doing me. Um, I don't know. I like to take pictures. Oh, really? Photography then? Yeah. I want to learn, like, how to set set the light and stuff. Yeah. I wanted to learn, but I still have no time, so. That's so cool. Do you have any, like, bonus Instagram account you post to of pictures? No, 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 Because no, people, no. you don't have a burner? Yeah, no, not yet, not yet, <laughs> oh, but I, yet. but I, um, I have my, like, own photo books. Came out, like, already, like, two. That's amazing. Yeah. Well, uh, we're so excited for the debut album, your so- mm-hmm. first solo project. Yeah. Um, oh. And it's so nice, all the things you do for your fans, so, like, Last wrap up. Anything you'd like to uh, say to all the fans who will be watching this? Oh, I, <laughs> um, I miss them so so much. Like I miss the vibe. Like I miss the concert. I miss the stage with them in front of me. Mm-hmm. Like because I, when I, when I was like um, during my solo, um, when I f- like I go like um, on stage, I don't have like them standing in front of me. Mm. So I feel kind of like. You know, I'm. I really miss them mm-hmm. because they always like give me a good energy all the time. Yeah, I really miss them. And then yeah, yeah I want every everything to be like safe, mm-hmm. like in a good place, like back to normal, and we can like meet up again. I really look forward to it. Oh, we cannot wait. And we're getting there. You can feel it. We're so close. Mm-hmm. Um, and so glad we got to talk to you before oh. everything kicks off because I'm sure you're going <laughs> to, I know you can't say all this stuff, but it's going to be coming soon. And again, we're just so excited for it. So thank you so much for thank doing you. this Odyssey check-in. Oh. Lisa, wish I had a whole crowd here like you just mentioned for oh. people here, but you and me, we got it. <laughs> thank you so much. Thank you.